welcome you all to my channel is this your first time of coming to my channel thanks a lot don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like share and subscribe i am a nigerian currently doing my msc here in poland and this week is basically a very busy week exam week so i'm starting this vlog on a sunday afternoon prepping for the week because you guys know that this week is full of exams and tests and also presentations so on monday we have globalization presentation on monday on wednesday i have microeconomics exam the practical exams on thursday i have international economics presentation on saturday i have econometric practical examination so you guys it's a busy week and in between like we still have lectures going on for courses that they haven't like finished their scheme of work yet courses are still going on so it's not like nigeria for an example where you have like lecture free week that you can read but yeah lectures can still be going on and you're having exams for another course right so you might see attend lecture for some courses and wife for some course you have exam on that day so that is how it's being run here so I'm going to be prepping for the week and the first thing I want to do is to make like stew because I don't feel like I need stew to sustain this week so that when I'm back I can just like make rice or just mix pack and then just eat with the stew so Sunday service was amazing it was good and I'm going to bring you guys along with me while I prep for the week and I'm also going to bring you guys along like throughout the presentation and everything so I also feel like you guys just in case if you are watching this vlog and you are done with school either first degree or second degree and you are thinking oh should I further do it just do it the moment you take a break and then you come back you are going to struggle like it's going to be like a real struggle because i feel like at that point your attention has shifted and you your attention has shifted to be honest like you are used to starting lifestyle and you have to go back to reading you have to like sacrifice so many things it's not going to be as easy as you know once you are done with first degree head up to your second degree once you are done move on to your phd if you are interested but the moment you have like break it automatically turns to struggle because it's not easy so come along with me while i cook i want to cook today and i also want to get some laundry done and uh, that's the agenda for today and later on in the evening i will go and study for the macroeconomics exam on wednesday so come along with me let's go Once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait A first time, a first day You're so fine, I'm so late First time, a first day You're so fine, I'm so late You sip wine, I drink straight Don't waste time to my place I feel my heart erase So catch me if I fall
so guys i'm done making lunch and also laundry so i'm heading out to the next room next hostel for someone to teach me we have an exam coming up on wednesday so it basically snowed yesterday and uh, let me show you guys like what it looks like a day after the snow this is what it looks like yeah so it's still quite cold but yeah let's go hi guys how you guys doing good morning so it's a monday morning and i have presentation on globalization so she basically listed out like eight topics and then you pick the topic you think you can present the most so for me i chose european union and that is what i'm going to be talking about today and the presentation is basically online so i'm going to show you guys how it goes union so in european union we have about 27 countries that are among the schengen country and poland happens to be one of them so guys i'm done with the presentation and it was okay um the next thing now is i have to eat so i need to warm like the food i made yesterday and then we have lectures by 12. so one thing i don't really like about this place or generally is the fact that in nigeria for an example you have lectures and then when it's time for exam you have like a week as lecture free week and then you have your exam so that week you know you're just having exam or for the two weeks you know you're just having exams but here you can be having exam and you're having lecture for another course it's just i don't know i think it's just like different from the normal nigerian system so after this presentation now i have class by 12. we have class this is this is 11 13 and this is the last person that is presenting now so the next thing i'll just wait to when this person is true just in case if they want to like mark attendance and then i need to eat shower and head up to school because we have lecture by 12 15 and the lecture is we have like about four lectures today basically but i think some are online and some are like physical so yeah that is how my monday is going but one thing i'm also so excited about today is that monday is my swimming day <laughs> so one of the fun activity and also like exercise because one of my goals for this year is to exercise and just be fit because i discovered that you need to exercise in a country like this because you just find out that you are not sweating you are not doing any hard job most of the tasks are just like mentally draining compared to like physical strength like nigeria for an example so one of my activity is to swim and my swimming days are on monday and today is monday so i'm so excited to swim i'm gonna show you guys you know when I get there, after my lectures, I went back to the hostel and then get ready to swim. <laughs> so I think that is basically like the major things for today. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign. be the greatest everybody on the face shit i look around and feel like everybody is the fakest i make this every day and i'm impatient hoping one day i blow up from the basement statement the top is so vacant i don't need shit that i think is amazing waiting for my day when i'm playing sold out shows for a thousand faces hey give me that crown get in my way and to be put down it ain't your place all this my town if i want that shit then i'll get it right now i'm losing it the noose if it's some loose shit a stupid myth you choose to live or choose to dip you choose to fight or lose your grip and lose a gift oh I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please Lord give me a sign So guys, today is Wednesday and we have macroeconomics exam so for today we have the practical parts of the macroeconomics so the practical parts basically 
here for an example they separate like the theory part and the practical part two different days in the exam so the practical part of macroeconomics is where you have like the calculations the curve the slope you know all those stuff like consumption is curve lm curve and all the calculations and all are under the practical part why for the theory part we have the exams next week so that is how it's been done here yeah. so there are also like courses for an example let's say like managerial economics as an example so the calculation part is the practical aspect so you have the practical aspect exam separate from the theoretical part on two different days you know so that's how they basically like run their exams and the practical and also because the classes too are also different so there are times where you have like the practical class which is like the calculation part or the graph part and there are also times where you have like the theor theoretical part of the course so likewise the exam also is different and there are some courses that you know the theoretical parts can be taken by a different lecturer and the theory parts by another lecturer or another professor basically so yeah i'm definitely getting ready for my exams today then tomorrow tomorrow is thursday i have a presentation on international economics i'm going to bring you guys along is a class presentation the one we had on monday that i showed you guys earlier we had the presentation is is a class presentation but online i showed you guys earlier but that was for globalization so the one we have tomorrow which is international economics is class presentation like in front of the class but anyways we're divided into two groups so group by group so i'm presenting tomorrow i'm going to bring you guys along with me while i present and this is actually like the first time i'm presenting physically in front of the class you know this is like my first time so yeah um this is like my first time so previously i've been presenting online because i came in very late so i did like most of my presentations online while i was still back home so i'm definitely going to bring you guys along tomorrow so let's just get ready let's read and then get ready for the exams <laughs> to bring you guys along i am basically visiting like places and i'm going to show you guys what it looks like so come along with me let's tour the town of poznan i feel like i'm losing my mind is everybody in the world blind please lord give me a sign so guys we got in here to have some breakfast and i'm going to show you guys what this restaurant looks like and then we'll head over to the other part where we are going to like see places basically i want to be the greatest everybody on the face shit i look around and feel like everybody is the fakest i make this every day and i'm impatient hoping one so guys let me show you guys how cute this place is i really love like the interior of this and the fact that it's like black and white and this is basically what it looks like you can see how cute it is yeah what do you guys think about it it's actually very nice so the team is basically like black and white vibes so guys so we've gone to the restaurant to have some breakfast and then i showed you guys like how it looks like it's actually like very cute and i really love the fact that it is black and white and it just gives like this matured kind of vibe yeah. so yeah <laughs> mall and look at the interior guys look at how cute it is this is like the roof the uppermost part of this mall and this is what it looks like you can see how cute it is so it just goes like round and they have like different shops here you can see so the lower parts are actually like shops let me zoom it in a bit so the lower part we have like different shops 
shopping malls and this is what it looks like so cute guys so guys just before we head into the museum let me show you guys like these pictures you can see how cute they are you can see how cute they are yeah. so guys i've showed you guys like what it looks like in this mall it's actually like very cute and we have like different stores yeah this is zara i don't know if you guys can see it so yeah so now we are basically heading out to the next location and then i'll bring you guys along <laughs> so guys i like this is the first floor and this is from the point where you guys can see this statue so this is like from the point where i started and this is like the first floor you guys this interior is actually so cute and you can see how cute it is <laughs> so they are just like different stores you know on every floor yeah i feel like i'm losing my mind is everybody in the world blind please lord give me a sign a sign i feel like i'm losing my mind is everybody in the world blind please lord give me a sign a sign I wanna be the greatest Everybody on the face shit I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest I make this Every day and I'm impatient Hoping one day I blow up from the basement Statement The top is so vacant I don't need shit that I So guys Now we are heading to the museum And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like I'm actually at the city center But because it's under construction So I cannot show you guys what it looks like So now Let's head up to the museum And lose your grip and lose a gift oh. I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? So guys, today is a very busy day and I am extremely tired So we went on a business trip presentation And after that we also had like two class presentations today And I'm so tired, like I left the house very early and I'm just so tired but the presentations are actually like practical exams and the business trip also is also like practical exams too so for different courses so that is how my day went i'll catch up with you guys tomorrow